So why use doceri? Because you want to express yourself. You want to share ideas that are very easy to share through writing, but maybe aren't so easy to type. You want to be able to communicate people, either with a large audience in a single room or remotely anywhere around the world. So how do you do this? Well, you write on an iPad with an intelligent good point stylus. What makes the stylus intelligent is that you can write with one side and then flip it over and erase with the other. The stylus also has palm rejection so that the software knows the difference between the pen and your fingers. And the use of this is that you can rest your hand on the iPad while you write without the iPad picking up extra strokes that you didn't intend. You can write, draw, control your computer, and all of your AV equipment through your iPad. Oh, and by the way, the stylus is optional. You can also just use your finger. So what is Doceri? Doceri is a software suite that lets you control your computer just like you do with your keyboard and mouse. In fact, you can do all of your keyboarding and mousing right through your iPad. Plus, you get handwriting and you can do it all remotely. So now you can present from anywhere in the room. You don't have to be at the front of your classroom in order to write on the board. You can write from anywhere in the room. You can author lessons over any background, and by any, I mean anything you can show on your computer. So if you can take a digital photograph of, of something, you can now write over it. If you can find an image online, you can write over it. Any software that's on your computer, you can write over it. PDF files, Word files, anything. And you can play back writing, just like I'm doing now. And you can slow things down, so I slowed the speed down. If I have a classroom full of students and I'm expecting them to copy down in their notes what I'm writing on the board, I can slow it down at this pace and then they can copy things at a reasonable um, pace. I'm going to speed it back up again. We also have stops. You'll notice that when I'm playing it plays a certain block of information and then it stops. And sometimes there are, it's clearing the screen before I'm going on to the next stop. We also have undo and redo. Uh, backstroke and forward stroke and other ways of playing things and this combination of features is what allows us to be able to edit on the fly. So I can write over what I've done and then delete my strokes if I want. If one of my students asks a question and I want to exit my presentation, I don't have to actually exit the presentation in order to be able to edit the presentation. This is an important distinction from software like PowerPoint. So I can simply clear the screen and then I can start writing and I can then go and play my presentation um, from where I am if I want or I can go back in time and delete my new strokes and then play from where I left off. So I can also change the backgrounds. There's a background folder that I'm going into right now, and there's a variety of different backgrounds that come pre-installed with the software. But I can put anything I want in, into that background folder. So I can put in photographs. Um, here's different colors that come preloaded. There's a number of different types of graph papers that are in here um, that are very useful for organizing your writing and a number of different types of papers that are included. So we'll put up um, a silver paper to finish this. And it comes with a pen palette with five pen tips, 35 colors, a transparency slider, so you can highlight overwriting. Um, you can write dotted lines very simply. You can write and erase and rewrite very easily. And there are other features to the software. And you can try Doceri for free, so I encourage you to download our free trial at doceri.com. Thank you.